Do you like it? Yeah, right. yeah, you're rocking it. Yeah. <laughs> Strutting like Rizzo. <laughs> oh, I love yeah. Rizzo. I love Rizzo. Yeah. Thank you. So tell us what is happening with, with you in, in the club. Obviously, you're back for a second series. Yes, so it starts tonight at nine. Well, all the girls are back. Everyone's in a different situation. My character, Diane, is waiting for her husband to come home from prison. Mm -hmm. She's had to start childminding, as well as already having four kids of her own, to sort of pay the mortgage. So her life is in turmoil. Yeah. She wants her husband back. He gets back, and he sort of makes things worse. <laughs> so, you know, okay, well, well, be careful what you wish for. Well, because she's the routine of being oh, well, without I can't him. Well, a little, there is yeah. a little bit of that, like mm. a bit like, oh, I'm sort of yeah. be independent I've got my now. Routine here. Yeah. But We're also, he just, um, he does something that I can't oh, tell you. Yeah. It's, it's quite Don't funny, but it's, yeah. With Hay Mallet gets right every single time. She's so good at realistically portraying those sort of awkward, awkward moments. moments. What, when your husband comes out of prison? <laughs> <laughs> Just in general, just the, the conversations. Yeah. 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 The relationships. Husbands and wives yeah, and relate yeah. people. Yeah, the person have. you love, you've got nothing to say to. Yeah. It's, um, yeah. yeah. It's, yeah. yeah. Well, well, I think as well, it's something that, apart from obviously the, the prison bit to, to one side, but just the whole experience of obviously we followed you through the sort of the antenatal classes and this <coughs> sort of thing. All of it, we're all, we're all mums, the majority of people watching at home, we know what it's like when you forge friendships with women that you'd never normally come into contact with, but the thing that's uniting you is you're, you're having a baby. Yeah, and you know, when I had my child, I didn't, I didn't get to go to any of those classes. I must have been working, I can't really remember how I didn't get to them, but, but I didn't have any, um, like, mum friends, and I didn't think anything about it at first, but when I did this show, I thought, oh... Did you feel like you'd missed out? I did, I thought, I, I don't have really any of those, important. yeah. And speaking of your, is, is Eight, isn't he? Today, oh, today. today. So I was going to say, say happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Newcastle at the weekend, and we did one of those. You know how all the kids want to do these trampoline and oh, yeah. things now. Oh, yeah. yeah, you yeah. know them. Yeah. yeah. So we went to one of those, and we went swimming, and we had a little party, and it was really cool. Oh. How yeah. do you find it working and having a son? Do you know I, I struggle? I actually really struggle. I am. Um, I really want to, you know, I do the job that I love and I want to feel creative and I want to do all of those things. But when I'm away from home, it, it, it hurts. Yeah. It really, I, I have You've the guilt, guilt, tremendous guilt, yeah. It so hurts I, us, though, I think, sometimes more than it hurts them, because children yeah. are quite yeah. resilient, yeah. aren't I'm they? I'm sure it does, actually, you know, and it's... Um, How old is he? Eight? Eight today? Yeah. And I think it's so, as they get older, I think it gets a bit harder actually, because mm. I think maybe they, they're more aware. Yeah, when they're they little, need you more to, to chat to, yeah. and you know. But then you yeah. might be used to it because you've always done it. You've got to think yeah. of it that way. He doesn't know any different than if you were at home all the time. Yeah. But you probably are at home more than you think. You probably just yeah, overthink I think I it. Yeah, probably am. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And how are things with you? Because you're you're in a lovely new relationship at the moment, I which am. is awesome. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Things going yeah, well. Really well. Yeah. Good. Yeah, it's really nice to just be with someone somebody you know who you know you sort of are planning a future with and you're happy with and everything yeah. just feels really I'd like to try that one <laughs> <laughs> Content. I do feel yeah. content. Yeah, and That's I feel lovely. like you know, through all of the the storms, have yeah. come you know the. the, the we all know what you mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. How did you meet? Um, we met through friends, which I was really pleased with. So somebody else thought that I would be, you know, m well matched to this person. Because I think sometimes your friends choose better than yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And did yeah. He, we, we were talking earlier about flirting. Yeah. Did he? Are you flirty? Was he flirty? Um, or he is quite flirty, and I think I am as well. But I don't think um, it. Ne he never makes it, me feel uncomfortable. Yeah. He never. You know, like you were That's saying about being secretive mm. and things like yeah. that. It's never that. It's more sort it's of gregarious. Just, yeah, yeah, really good conversation, charm and person, mm. and, you know, that's why I was attracted to him in the first place. Yeah, of course. Yeah. And we, obviously, you, you won Strictly all those years ago. Mm. How long ago was it now? It was a good wee years, while. I think. <gasps> oh, <God. laughs> wow. Have you been dancing since? Or? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. You, done, you did a Christmas that. special, though, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, I've, I've so done the, the, the tour and a few Christmas specials, but I haven't done, like, dance classes, no. Oh, yeah. I would love the though. outfits. I'd love to do it just for the outfits. Oh, I know. It was, it was so cool. It was amazing. It's hard work, though, I bet. It really yeah. was, yeah. yeah. yeah but... 
brilliant. Though. So obviously, you know, In The Club is, is coming out tonight. What else have you got to look forward to? Um, well, I've just finished filming um, a series called Ordinary Lies, so that should be out. Oh, I love that. that. Yes, that great. Was great. That yeah. is so good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so when's, so good. when's that going to be coming out? I don't out? know. I'm not sure when that's going to come out, but it'll be, um, be sometime yeah. later on this year. Yeah. Fabulous. Yeah. Oh, good. Brilliant. Have you started out in Biker Grove? I is did. that right? Yeah. 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 Oh, so you were, it. what, 14? I was 13 when I got that part, and I wow. thought I'd died and gone to heaven. Are you still friends with Vance and Deck? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Cool. Donna. Yeah, done it. Wow. Yeah. 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 yeah, it's yeah. really brilliant. brilliant. Well, Jill, we're looking forward to tonight, of course, uh, the second series of, of In the Club. Thank you for popping in to see us today. Jill Hoffman, you're welcome. Right. To watch more interviews with a whole range of famous faces and click here to subscribe. It's free, so you'd be silly not to, really. I once yeah. won an award in Liverpool and I couldn't attend. <laughs> yeah. And my dad went in my place. <laughs> And I got a text off John Bishop saying, your dad's been on stage for 25 minutes and not mentioned your name. <laughs> <laughs> he, said, he said, but he's storming it. <laughs> <laughs>